Now, we're going to talk about the difference between a syntactic category and a sentence. Remember, we said that sentences are full ideas while syntactic categories are not. Okay? So, a sentence is, I like ice cream, for example. This is a full idea. I am is a full sentence because it talks about your existence. I am. Yes. So you don't need too many words to make a sentence. Okay. Sentences can be short or long. But sentences always contain two elements. The first one, the person, the animal, the object the topic you're talking about called the subject and the second one the verb the status or the action that the person is doing so i like ice cream here you have i is the subject and like ice cream would be the predicate the predicate is everything that is not the subject Okay. Usually, the predicate starts after the subject. Okay. And there is a verb right after the subject. Okay. Let's talk about I like ice cream. Okay. What if I say she, for example? She likes ice cream. Okay. I can say she, but I can transform my sentence and say, for example, that lady likes ice cream. The subject of the sentence is she in this case, but then that lady likes ice cream, the subject is that lady. If I say that old lady likes ice cream, the subject of the sentence is that old lady. If I say that old lady who is constantly uh, throwing things to the street whenever it rains, comma, likes ice cream. What do you think the subject of the sentence is? Lady? No. The subject of the sentence finishes when the verb starts. This is the main verb. Likes. That means the subject of the sentence is all that. Okay? That old lady who is constantly throwing things to the street whenever it rains would be the subject of the sentence. 